Hi, I'm Ken Bennett, Secretary of State for the State of Arizona. My name is Jim Drake. I'm the Deputy Secretary of State for Arizona. Hello, I'm Hal Owens with Precision Components. So I'm Doyle Kahabka with SDB. Hi, I'm Jim Musman, Precision Heavy Hull. Uh, this morning we are setting the two gun barrels from the battleships Arizona and the Missouri. And just a little bit of history as to how the project came together. A gentleman who used to work at the House of Representatives when I was in the State Senate, his name is John Thomas. He uh, is kind of a World War II history buff and, and ran across an, a story that mentioned that the Navy still had one remaining gun barrel from the battleship Arizona. And the idea occurred to him to see if the Navy would give it to us and we could put it out here in the plaza next to the anchor and the masthead that we already have from the Arizona. So he came to my office about three years ago. He said, would I as the Secretary of State take the lead in contacting the Navy and seeing if they would give us that one remaining gun barrel from the Arizona? At first they were hesitant because it was the last one that they had. They actually offered us one from the USS Missouri, a barrel from the Missouri battleship that was at the end of the war. The Japanese came on and signed the surrender. And so I thought that maybe we should ask for one of each. And when I did, he, he got all excited about uh, the idea of having what we called the bookends of the war, uh, a gun barrel to memorialize the beginning of the war, the sinking of the Arizona at Pearl Harbor, and then one from the Missouri, the surrender of the Japanese in September of 45. So for the last two and a half to three years, we've been working on getting those gun barrels here to Arizona. We're not using any tax dollars. All of the money that we're using has been private contributions or companies like Precision Heavy Haul and others that are donating their services to help make this project happen. It's been an honor to be part of this project, uh, to build a new memorial downtown, and today's the day they're getting ready to load up and depart for the new memorial. Uh, Secretary Bennett approached us about a year and a half ago uh, to ask if we would donate construction management services and through our relationships of being a 33-year local contractor, get in-kind donations to help build this memorial dream that Ken had. We've got Marco Crane here today that's donated crane and rigging services, uh, precision heavy haul with the big trailer to move the Missouri gun barrel and then Empire Cat is going to be moving the Arizona. We'll leave here tomorrow morning and take them down to their final resting place at the Wesley Bolin Plaza at the Guns to Salute the Fallen Memorial. We did accept the job in working with the Secretary of State's office in SDB, the contractor on this. We're donating our services and providing a 14-line goal hopper and the prime mover and the crew. We loaded the barrel out today and we're moving at 7 a.m. tomorrow morning from downtown Phoenix to the Wesley Bowen Plaza where the memorial will be set up. Uh, we're very honored to be part of this move. Just our way of also saluting the fallen. I am about the proudest person out here in this uh, Capitol Mall right now. Um, as you can see behind me, the Missouri barrel is about to be lifted into place. It's the end of about a three-year project uh, with locating the barrels and uh, getting them towed out here through Burlington Northern and lifted on the East Coast. Because when the whole plan came together, they were all the way out in Virginia and we had to bring them all the way across the country and refurbish them and refinish them and sandblast them and paint them and then we had the, uh, the memorial actually being constructed. So it's been a long process and we can certainly see the, uh, the, end, of the, the end of the project is near now. We're going to have the unveiling on December 7th and it uh, should be a very fitting memorial to all the Arizonans who, who lost their lives in World War II. Setting the gun barrels from the battleships USS Arizona and USS Missouri. I want to thank Precision Heavy Hall uh, for their, their ownership and all of their employees uh, for helping us with this project. They transported one of the barrels over here. We couldn't have done it without Precision Heavy Hall and we appreciate their support for this worthy project, part of Arizona's new World War II Memorial. Thank you very much. Thank appreciate you. it. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you.